What's going on everybody? This is Woody with Wired Customs Motorsports located in Cleveland, Texas. And today we're going to be doing an unboxing sort of first overview of the Audio Dynamics 2000 series shallow 10 inch subwoofer. Um, already got the box open here, save a little bit of time. One thing I will say is this sub is very well packaged. Uh, not likely to get damaged in shipping. Which I do like a lot. All right, here we go. The 2510 from Audio Dynamics. Now this sub is a dual voice coil, dual two and a half inch copper voice coil. Uh, this particular sub is a dual forearm. And man, this thing is, it's built well. You can tell the build quality on this sub is insane. Uh, the mounting depth is only three and three quarters of an inch, uh, and shallow sub, right? This will fit in a lot of shallow or small locations. Um, even if you have say a full size vehicle, SUV, car, trunk, what have you, and you don't want to take up a whole lot of space, this is the sub for you. They rate this sub at three to 600 Watts, uh, optimal power range which for a sub in this category and this price range is, is very good. Um, I would run that at 600 watts all day knowing this brand uh, and the quality they put out. And I, th these terminals too, man, it's a part of the actual basket itself. So these aren't gonna bend, twist, break on you like you see in a lot of other subwoofers uh, that aren't as well built as these. The comb material seems to be very, very good. Stiff, how it's kind of, I don't know if you can see, but bubbled almost. It gives it a little extra strength um, and rigidity. And on their website, uh, this particular sub has 15 millimeters of X-Max, of excursion. And for a shallow speaker, I thought that was very, uh, very well. I'm excited to put this into a box and test and see its full potential. Uh, we'll keep you guys updated on that. But until then, if you need any Audio Dynamics products, be sure to send us a message. Uh, Facebook, we have YouTube, Instagram. Again, Buyer Customs Motorsports located in Cleveland, Texas.